OK, really pleased to say we've been joined by the club's new signing, Matty Willock, who signed on a two-year deal from Manchester United. Uh, Matty, first of all, welcome. How do you feel to have signed for us? Yeah, really delighted. Uh, can't wait to get going and uh, really excited to meet my new teammates and to get playing. I mean, after leaving Old Trafford, obviously Man United's a, a huge club, so when it came round to picking your next club, what were your main priorities as a player? Well, I've been on loan um, the last two years, so um, I just wanted to carry on my development and playing men's football. Um, I thought this was the perfect opportunity for me. It's a good club um, with high ambitions, so I thought uh, this would be the great. This would be a great next step for me. Steve Evans was singing your praises to me earlier. He said you had a few options on the table. So, what was it about Gillingham that made you want to sign for us? Um, like I say, it's a good club, high ambitions. I know a couple of players here already, um, and I spoke to them, and they said it's a, it's a good club. Um, plus, the manager really showed faith in me, um, and it seemed like he really wanted me here. Um, so that was a big, massive factor in me coming here. When did you first hear from the gaffer? Obviously, the season finished a, a little while ago. When was your first contact with him? Um, I think he made contact with Man United uh, as soon as the season finished, I think, um, and just uh, asked for my contact details. Um, so that was that was another reason I came. He was uh, the was really eager to get me here. Um, so it was a big factor in me coming here. He tells me you come with a, a glowing reference from a, a certain uh, Nicky Butt at Manchester United. What other players or coaches did you work with at Old Trafford that our fans might be familiar with? Um, I worked with. Well, I'm a midfield player, as you know. So I worked with Paul Scholes. Um, he was my under nineteen. Manager with Nicky Bart. Um, it's not a bad coach to have Paul Scholes, is it? Really? Yeah, yes, thanks. It. <laughs> Brilliant coach. Michael Carrick. Um, yeah, that was probably the, the two main ones for me. You mentioned you've been out on loan a few times. You were probably the back end of, of, of last season. How confident are you that you can consistently perform at League One on a high level? Yeah, I enjoyed my time at Crawley. It was a good club. Um, I learned a lot. Um, I think that. League One's obviously a higher level, it's the next step for me, and I think I'm ready to, to move on. For those who haven't seen you play, how would you describe yourself as a player? Obviously a midfielder, but what are your main strengths in your opinion? Um, I work hard, um, I try and drive forward with the ball, um, energetic in the midfield, yeah, that's my main strengths. And familiar faces in the dressing room, there was a picture of Regan Giles Cook on the way up and I think you've played with him before. Yeah, I know Regan quite well, um, he came through the Arsenal Academy with me up until I was 16, I played with him, um, he's a good friend of mine, so I'm looking forward to seeing him. So having now signed, what are the plans now, is it a holiday, you go away, do some fitness and then back for pre-season or? Yeah, that's exactly it, yeah. um, I've been working with a personal trainer. So um, I'm already a little bit fit, but I'm going to really step it up now because I know pre-season is going to be hard, as it always is. Um, so I'm going to make sure I'm ready when I come back. Superb. Matty, best of luck. Thank you. Cheers.